We would like to acknowledge the traditional owners of the land on which we record today, the Turrbal and Yuggera people. We pay our respects to Elders past and present. Aboriginal land always was, always will be. Sovereignty was never ceded. Hello, my name is Gina. Hello, my name is Amy. And we are As As Good As As It Gets. Yellow, yellow. How's it going? What do you know? We'll strike a light. What? (laughs) Do you know what that is? I don't know why I said yellow, yellow when it's really g'day, g'day. Uh, Right. How's it going? Anyway. (laughs) Welcome back to As Good As It Gets. I'm one of your hosts. My name is Gina Against My Will. And across from me, what's her name? A I M E E. Amy. <laughs> That's how you spell your name. Why did you <laughs> look confused just then? I was like, did I get it wrong? My name is entirely phonetically. So when people are like, oh, that's an interesting spelling, I'm like, it's literally how you say it. How do you get, okay, I hear you, but how do you get away with that I then? Aim. You spell the word aim. aim I'm with you. I'm with you. Sorry. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I understand. Yeah. Yeah. That's like Gina, G-W-N-A. They're like, oh, that's so interesting. I'm like, just spell Gina. (laughs) Sound it out, babe. Yeah, fuck off. (laughs) Anyway, Amy, knock, knock. Who's there? Yoda lady. Yoda lady who? Stop yodeling. (laughs) (laughs) I knew where it was going. Did you? Yeah. Damn it. Okay. That was good. How are you going, Ames? Fine. (laughs) Got a bunch of laughs up in here today. (laughs) What do you mean fine? I'm tired. It's been a big day. Well, get over it. I've been working. Have you? Yeah. Me too. Oh, yes. So I work at a place <laughs> where people go to have fun. Uh, can't I, relate. That's it. <laughs> Never been. Never. Um, I don't want to say where I work or what type of work it is, mm-hmm. but just where people go to have fun and play games, mm-hmm. basically. And there's one experience where there is a actor in the experience with you, basically. Mm. And today I was that actor. Oh. And there's something really fun when you get a team that like really vibes with you and like banters back and laughs at everything you say. Mm-hmm. And it was really fun. And there were a couple of cute guys. He he ha ha. He he he. And then I left soon after them and I was in the um, elevator with them. And as I got out, I was like, okay, bye guys, be safe. Ha ha ha. And as the doors shut, you know, when you, people look at you like you put stars in the sky. (laughs) No. (laughs) (laughs) Amy, what? (laughs) Um, Yeah. So they were kind of looking at me like that. And as the doors shut, one of the girls goes, oh, she's gorgeous. I'm like, yeah. Oh, my God. Stop. (laughs) Anyway, so I never seen them again. Um, (laughs) But that made me feel good. I was like, that's why I like my job 2% of the time. Gina, you never responded to my message earlier in the week. And I don't know if you saw it. What was it? Um, Because then we were talking about something else. (laughs) So I was um, in Toowoomba last weekend and I sent you a message and I was like, hey, I was like, I just met this girl and she's also from Cairns and asked for, and I was talking, because I was talking about our podcast or something. Said you were from Cairns. She's from Cairns. She asked for your name. I told her your name. She stalked you. <laughs> and she was like, I don't think I know her. And she was like, but everyone knows everyone. She was like, oh, but she's gorgeous. She's so pretty. Thanks. And I told you this and you ghosted me. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> no, I think like to get a bit personal, which we never do on this pod. <laughs> and I never overshare to people on ever. the internet. Ever. But. I lately I have been really getting annoyed at the fact that men want to fuck me and nobody likes me. So I did see that message and when she when when you were like, "Oh, she's gorgeous." I'm like, "Yeah, well, th- and yet I'm still alone and single and nobody wants to treat me right." So it's like it, I think it's established that I am good looking. of the time when I put in the effort. Also, I think it's like that's a curated version of myself Mm. that I put on Instagram and the internet. Mm -hmm. So it's like, yes, of course, this woman who took three hours to get ready 
people find attractive. But that woman isn't me. That's a curated <laughs> version of me. You know what I mean? It's a part of you. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I just can't remember the last time anyone called me beautiful or pretty or whatever when I wasn't wearing makeup. You know what I mean? I'm just like, yeah, okay. Oh, I look good today when I fucking wash my hair and am wearing makeup. Oh, it's a surprise. <laughs> Like, yeah, you know what I mean? No one expected it ever. That's, a, I'm just, uh, lately I've been like, oh, you want, oh, you're attracted to me? Fucking get, like, who cares? Okay, well, I I'll know be sure this. to pass this on to the straight woman who commented on your appearance. No, it's very lovely. I'm just kind of, I'm over it. Yeah. Do you understand? No. Oh. <laughs> no, surely. Anyway, Amy, what are we doing today? Uh, uh, well, we're going from strength to strength here, Gina. Uh <laughs> I'd love to know how you doing with your uh, new month's resolution. Amy, yeah. how are you doing with your <laughs> new month's resolution? No, no, Gina, how are you doing with your <laughs> so new month's this, resolution? So this month, my new month's resolution was to get all my Christmas shopping done mm. in the month of November so I didn't have to do it in December when school's fucking out. Mm-hmm. Um, so, yeah, Amy, how are you doing? <laughs> Uh, look, I've got to be honest with you, Amy. Mm. I've, I moved house a couple of days ago yes. and have I done anything but move house? No. Do I know what I'm even buying people for Christmas? No. Mm. Has Secret Santa even been drawn? No. But I am quietly confident. <laughs> no, I just really want to get it done. I'm like, fucking pull the Band-Aid off. Yeah. Let's, let's do it, fellas. Yep. You know what I mean? <laughs> So, so far doing badly. Great. But there's hope. <laughs> but Much like my life. <laughs> there's a glimmer of light at the end of the tunnel. Very small. But there. Very thin. <laughs> <laughs> like me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Amy, your new month's resolution. What is it? Um, how are you going? I can't remember how I phrased it, but. Oh, I remember. Yes. Yes. It was uh, to create content that was like my top three of 2023 and do create like a little series so it might be like three beauty recommendations three clothing xyz um mm -hmm. gina i can tell you that progress has been made oh um and i so far have figured out uh, uh. how to make noises (laughs) i was just reading uh i I know how difficult that is five series Five, five like categories. Oh, do you need to narrow it down or are you going to do five? I think I'll do five. Crazy. Or I'll like switch them out or do something else. I don't Can know. Can you tell us on that? No, secret. Oh, <laughs> I hate secrets. Oh, That's no, why I, I never ca- keep any. <laughs> yeah, I can tell you the categories. Mm. So, so far we have, um, okay, these two I feel like I need different names for because one is more beauty or makeup and the other I guess is maybe skincare. But let's say beauty, skincare, clothing, Movies slash series mm. and jewelry. Okay, all right. Um, yeah. So that's why are like, you doing the movies slash series when you never watch anything I fucking recommend? Because that's mm-hmm. how few I've watched that they are joined. Yeah, for <laughs> to fuck's be sake, me. honestly. <laughs> um, so I've done some planning. Just have to do the actual content. Well, that's not bad. I think it's all right. That's some progress. I'm like thirty percent. That's all right. That's yeah. better than zero. It's true. And I've always said that. <laughs> now, Amy, enough of that. What are we doing mm. this uh, this episode? Well, we thought we would bring back uh, a segment that the people have been asking for. Have they? Gina, our inbox has been <laughs> flooded with requests. <laughs> Request? What? Requests? Request? Am I saying that right? Requests. I don't know anymore. <laughs> Re- what? Request. Requeques. Yeah. Request. <laughs> I want no requi <laughs> 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 um, Anyway, look, yeah. what are we doing? All yeah, right, we're doing none of my business. <laughs> yeah, there it is. And Gina, what is none of my business? It's none of anyone's business, mm, really. Yes. If you don't understand it, you don't need to. If you don't want to, you don't have to. Mm. It's very self explanatory and you'll understand as soon as we start. And Amy, mm. start us off. All right, Gina. Mm. No, none of my business. Yeah. What chicken salt is actually made of? Mm. <laughs> Why does it? But it does taste like chicken. No, but here's the thing. So let me tell you. <laughs> yeah. I know why it was made. I don't know how it's made. Why, why was it made? Chicken salt was made as a seasoning for rotisserie chickens. 
So what? that's how it came to be. It was like, oh my god, that's why it's called chicken salt. So because it was like intended to season oh. chicken. Is right? it still on rotisserie chickens? I don't know, but it's not made of chicken. But why does it taste like chicken? <laughs> <laughs> It doesn't. Explain <laughs> that to me. Explain that to me. No, I agree. We mm. don't need to know. I don't need to know, but I do know it's delicious. <laughs> I'll fucking know that. <laughs> That's my business, the way it tastes. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Amy, none of my business. Mm. The childbirthing process. Oh. <laughs> oh. And I do mean that because I'll never birth a child and I never fucking have to know. Oh. I ain't doing it. It ain't happening. Uh, yeah, I don't know about that one. Because there's so many things that happen that they don't tell you about. Like, did you know you have to give birth, as you give birth, and then after that you have to give birth to the placenta? I didn't know that till I was like 24. I just, there's so Why much. Why are they teaching people that? Okay, you know, a segue off that. Yeah. <laughs> None of my business uh-huh. at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> at least. Mm. Like being a parent. Oh, God. How do you, wait, how do you, because some of my friends have children they that have must be real really hard people yeah who have come out of them no and i'm like how do you know what to do yeah what do you it's mean it's not intuitive bro like that's why you know the whole oh a mother's touch or a mother's blah 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 no nah, like that's how misogyny starts because men go oh i'm just not a mother well mothers don't get the blueprint either but unfortunately it just lands on them it's like every parent is learning how to parent all the time i'm like maybe is a woman just default more responsible and so has a yeah, better, because of like, misogyny m- more common sense to be like hey i reckon we don't throw our child off the balcony and dad's like oh so true yes i don't know uh yeah that's a topic for another time okay but understandable yes mm. no parenting not for me mm. none of my business all right gina yeah none of my business mm-hmm. how much the retail markup is on the cost of jewelry Oh, God, how do you – that doesn't – that's – you know what? None of my business, the retail markup of anything. Yeah. (laughs) How does that work? God, it's How do you factor in wages, profit, other stuff? Yeah. Electricity, rent into like a shirt. Who came up with the number? I don't get it. I don't – like what? (laughs) That's why I'm never going to be a business owner because Mm. I go, oh, that looks like none of my business. Mm. You know what I mean? Yes, I do. Um, none of my business. What mm. I look like when I'm dancing. Oh, why not? I think that would be quite delightful. <laughs> <laughs> no, because when I'm dancing, I'm free. And <laughs> I don't need to know what I look like when I'm feeling free. You know what I mean? Because I don't think it's sexy. I don't think it's cool. I don't think it's pretty. I think it's... Free. I think it's what freedom looks like. And freedom has never been pretty. You know what I mean? And freedom just isn't sexy. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, that's, well, let's not say that. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Gina. Yep. None of my business. Mm-hmm. How colours got their name and who decided them? <sighs> <laughs> no, like that's real. That's what like what was named first, orange the colour or orange the fruit? Oh. And why... Like watermelon, right? Mm. Watermelon green. Mm. Yep. So why was green not called watermelon? You know what I mean? Like, oh. or like, yeah. And because it's like, if you see something that's watermelon, it's pink, right? Yeah. If it was like, I'm getting watermelon tights, oh. it'll be pink tights. Yeah. Not green tights. Or pink and green. And I understand because pink is the inside of a watermelon, but like, mm. what's wrong with the, the shell? I don't get it. Who named things? I don't know. And who said, yeah, okay, like a yacht? Who Mm. fucking got away with that? Yacht. And and the spelling of yacht? Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like what? (laughs) I'm just getting on my yakata. (laughs) (laughs) Do you want to join me on my yakata? (laughs) Mm, Princess. Um, None of my business. The Compass app on my phone. Oh. <laughs> Has anyone used that, that ever? Can get right in the bin. What, what a waste it? of space. Just in general compasses. What are they doing? Hmm. I'm not orienteering. Never. Even if someone gave me a compass and I was in the woods lost, I would... What's that going to do? I look at it and be like, <laughs> awesome, I'm heading southeast. <laughs> but where do I need to head? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Tell me where the road is, compass, and I shake it like a eight ball. <laughs> 
when I'm like using Google Maps and it's like head southeast, I'm like Siri. I don't know where <laughs> southeast is. I'm just a 27 year old girl. I need names of roads. Yeah. What do you mean? Or like head towards the KFC. Sne- sne- <laughs> <laughs> head towards the KFC near your house, and I'd be like, I know where that is. Yes. You know what I mean? Don't tell me to go west, babe. I'll west. fucking west myself. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, Amy, what do you got for All me? All right, Gina. Yeah. None of my business. Mm. How many germs are actually on my body at all times? No. Mm. We don't need to think about that. Why are you thinking about that? I don't know. Intrusive thoughts. Yep. <laughs> don't like them. Don't like them. It's like mm-hmm. when I found out that when you go to the toilet and you use the air dryer in the toilet, that's oh. actually worse than letting your hands air dry or wiping them on your clothes. Why were they invented then? They're A, noisy, B, not even that good, and C, gives you more germs. I don't understand. They're literally failing at everything it's meant to do. <laughs> and we keep installing them. I want it. I don't like it at all. Mm-mm. Um, none of my business. The hairs on my toes. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean that. I mean that. That's none of my business. How do you still shave the hairs on your toes? No. Yeah. What? No way. I'm not going to risk still... getting a little cut on my toe knuckle. It's like nobody's down there anyway. No. And who cares? Oh, I have hair on my body where hair men- is meant to grow. Get over it. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? That's small dick energy if you that's, care about that. Oh, that's big small dick energy. Oh, what? <laughs> it's big small. <laughs> it's big small. Not small big. What is small big dick energy? Mm, like it's just past the like, yeah, okay, I'll like, allow oh, it, yeah. but it's only just. I like that. We should bring mm. that in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, the hairs on my toes. I pff, Get over it. Yeah. You know what I mean? No, nah, they suck. <laughs> Yours in particular, Gina. Oh. <laughs> All right, Gina. Mm. None of my business. Mm-hmm. Where the saying "I'm so hungry I could eat a horse" comes from? <laughs> like, if, yeah. If everyone could see my face just then, I am flummoxed by that. <laughs> like, who's saying they're eating horses? I know. Did someone and why? actually? And you know, okay, here, here's what I'm thinking. Yeah. Old mate <laughs> yeah, has yeah. actually eaten a horse before because he was like, "Man, I'm hungry." <laughs> And then he's just like having a chat. He's really hungry again with friends. And he's like, oh, I'm so hungry. I got to eat a horse. And they're like, Barry. But you have done that, Barry. <laughs> what? That's not a big thing. <laughs> okay. I've had another thought here. What mm. if it's like back in the olden times when <laughs> horses were the cars of the road? So what if they're mm. like, I'm so hungry I could eat my vehicle? And they're like, well, that'd be silly. You can't eat your horse. How'd you get home? Well, that's you very know what I mean? silly because I'd never say I'm so hungry I could eat my car. Yeah, but uh, horses are meat is what I'm saying. Nah. <laughs> no, do, but do you see where I'm coming from? I see what you're saying. It's almost like I I, I'm like so it. hungry I could eat my dog. It's like that's a bit fucked. That's Jesus. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> no, I'm not saying that. Gina, stop <laughs> eating your dog. <laughs> that's why I can't have any. <laughs> they're so yummy. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Sorry. Oh. <laughs> Who did that one? Oh, you. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, none of my business. Mm. How much I'm going to use my aircon this summer despite global warming? <laughs> I just, I know global warming exists. I know it's all fucking us up. I know we have to save the planet literally T minus two years ago. Yeah. But fuck me, I'd rather eat a horse than not use aircon. It is already so hot. Yeah, it's fucked. Hey, today was disgusting. I was lucky today that I was at work in aircon, but mm. yesterday I was at home. Okay, this oh. is what I was thinking about you. I think your place is really cute. But it was an oversight on your part to get a place without any aircon. It wasn't an oversight because ha- not having aircon has never bothered me. That is insane to me, Amy. But this house yeah. <laughs> is hot. Right. And I didn't know that when I moved in in winter in July. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's really already never, really hot. You've never been bothered, bothered about not having aircon? No, because my last place didn't have working aircon. <laughs> That's and wild to the, me. Uh, I've only oh, I've had working aircon in my first two places, and it was a very nice luxury to have. But I didn't have it for a long time, I guess, growing up either. Mm. So I, I think I'm the opposite to you because when I was a kid living in far north fucking Queensland, mm. um, my dad and a, a little bit of my mum 
like I don't know if the word is cheap but even it's stinking up there like it's just fucked it's like Mm. you're in an oven 90% of the year and we'd be begging dad to put on the air con and he'd be like oh fucking god it's not even that bad just sit under the fan and here I am like in my underwear laying on the tiles <laughs> under the fan he's like oh you're fucking dramatic you're bloody bad so now as an adult air con is like no no let's put that shit on yeah. I don't want to be uncomfortable for the next 20 years because I'm not gonna live any longer <laughs> Because that's just the plan that yeah. I've got. No, but I definitely think for my next place, like... Aircon is essential. I need it. Like you say, yeah. it's a luxury. To me, it's a necessity. Mm. Like, I don't want to live in another house that doesn't have aircon. Mm. That's how, like... Yeah, no, that's fair enough. I think... If that's a me thing, though. The bigger thing for me, though, is mm. more than myself, is seeing how hot Jenga gets. Mm. My boy, my cat. And you could get one of, like, those... Not disposable... <laughs> Those box air cons that you buy. Mm. I mean, I've got like, you know, little fans and stuff. So I think that'll just have to do for yeah. the summer and whatever. But yeah, someday, like yesterday when I was at home, it was mm. so hot. Like I was sweating. He's just like on the floor, passed out. Like, yeah. I'm like, my boy. Yeah, poor And he, that's where boy. he lives. Yeah. That's, so he can't get air con anywhere else. He can't get. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> Amy's just crying. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Amy, uh. you'll go. Uh, Gina, this is my last one. Crazy. None of my business. Mm-hmm. Mold. <sighs> mm. In any in, capacity. Yeah, okay. Like yes. wh- how it happens or like where it is. All of the above. <laughs> yeah, I think there's mold on my shower oh. um, door handle. Like, you know how some showers have handles to get in? Yes. And it's on the inside. Uh, I'm like, oh, when I touch it, I'm like, oh. I, how do you fix that? How do you get mould off things? I don't know. And I also, like, Science. half the time don't even know what mould looks like. Like, True. It I, can come in many forms. I just, I am not good at mould. Yeah. <laughs> and I remember at my last place, my mum came um, and was an angel and Bon cleaned the bathroom. Oh, bless And her. just like spotted some mold like in the shower. And she's like, when did you last clean this? And I'm like, I don't know. What are you talking about? Cleaning? I get in the, a shower, in the shower. <laughs> it cleans itself. It's self-cleaning. Yeah, it's, it's self-cleaning. <laughs> yeah, good on your mum. Yeah. That's another thing I'm never doing again. Bond clean. Ugh. You'd have to put a gun to my head because I'm not doing that. Mm. I'm not doing that. Um, None of my business. Mm. What I say once I've said it. <laughs> 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 like uh, for, for I say some of the dumbest, silliest, smartest, sexiest, <laughs> nonsensical things. But mm. once I said it, it's really none of my business. It's in the past. It's <laughs> get over it. Stop living. You know in what the I mean. Past. Stop bringing it up. Life is for the present and the future. Like sometimes I listen back to our podcast. I'm like that. You should. Why'd you say that? <laughs> Why did you tell the listeners at home about your ex-boyfriend? That wasn't very slay of you. That wasn't very mysterious. Doesn't matter. It's in the past. Exactly. Mm. None of my business. No. And I've always said that. <laughs> oh, uh, God. And Gina, does that bring us to the end of none of my business? Yeah, I think it does. Okay, cool. Short and sweet. <laughs> nice. You know? Slay. Oh, God. What a week. Mm. What a year. What a life. Actually, speaking of nothing, <laughs> mm. to the listeners at home, as much as you want to say, it's not December yet, but your 2023 so far, out of 10, what would you rate it? Are you asking me? Yes. <laughs> No, the other people in this room. Well, it could be any of them. <laughs> I thought you were framing it as a question to the listeners. No, I don't care about them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I do. I do, actually. Uh, oh. Out of ten. And don't fucking lie because I'll know it. A six. Really? Yeah. Okay. Like, I think overall I'd have to say it's better than average. But Oh, that's nice. There's been a lot of... There's been some <laughs> stuff, hasn't there? Yeah. Yeah. What about sure. you? You don't want to know. I do. <laughs> <laughs> this year, oversharing has been one of the worst years of my life. Mm. <laughs> so I'm going to put it at like a 0.5. Oh, Gina. And I'm like, I wish I was kidding. I yeah. wish I was like, ha, 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 just kidding. It's, it's a three. Mm. No, it's a 0.5. Mm. <laughs> I just like, I was talking to my best friend the other day and I was like, could it get worse? Just kidding. That's not a 
double dog there universe yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah just let me get to the end of the year mm. please or not gina <laughs> yeah don't look at me like that hey <laughs> <laughs> yeah what <laughs> <laughs> what do you Gina, want? <laughs> tell me what got you good this week. Oh, Amy, I've tried to not talk about it all this podcast. Oh my god, what? I've moved into my new house. <laughs> I've moved in, baby. Ah! Yes, that's right. That's right. How's it going? Oh my god. Actually, being in there is a sleigh. Because I didn't want to move out of the other one. The other one was like my little cave, my yeah. little hole. I loved it there. So mm. when we got evicted unfairly by the bank, yeah, um, very sad times for me. Yes. But this new place, my room's bigger, Ooh. better view, and a linen closet. Oh, I know. And one of my roommates just bought a couch. Oh, nice. And oh. she's bought a new TV for herself, so her old TV will go in the lounge room. And this TV isn't my 2014 mm-hmm. <laughs> computer screen TV that only accesses, what do you call that, free to air? Yeah, yep. This TV might have like Netflix and oh things. My God. It'll be the size of an actual TV. That's pretty cool, hey? So I could that's watch really TV cool. in the living room. On like a TV. Like do it. Yeah. You know? That's <laughs> How nice. How crazy. That's good stuff. <laughs> so, yeah, it's a bit of a sleigh, apart mm. from the mould in the shower. Um, potato, potato. You know, <laughs> you win some, you lose more. <laughs> and <laughs> Sounds like a like a betting thing. Yeah. Like a gambling helpline. Yeah. yeah. Maybe it is. Maybe I stole that. Yeah, that <laughs> Maybe. You win some, if, you lose more. And if I didn't steal that and I have TM'd that, don't you fucking steal that big mm. gamble, mm. big gambling, big farmer. Big, big you know g- what I mean? <laughs> don't don't take that big, yeah. Big, big money. Big <laughs> money. <laughs> big pokies. Don't take that. Big, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Amy. <sighs> Gina. What got you good, my love, okay. my dove? I actually have great news. Oh, I can't believe you've kept this to yourself, you <laughs> naughty nurse. What? What is it? Um, mm. I got yes Taylor Swift tickets. <gasps> oh, wow. Yep. Wow. That's yep. pretty amazing. Where, when, how. Okay. And who so, all again right. is Taylor Swift? <laughs> who, is, who is that? So here's artists. the thing, right? Yes. The second round of tickets went on sale. Yeah. Missed out on those. Oh. And I was like, all right. Yeah. So my only hope is the resale, which I think is next week, of like yeah. existing tickets through the Ticket Tech Marketplace, XYZ. Anyway. Marketplace, yeah. yeah. And I was like, oh, man. I was like, my dreams are dwindling. This is a very sad time. Mm. In walks an angel. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? Is it me? Uh, no. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. A young lass by the name of Alyssa Rita, oh. who I work with. Alyssa Rita. Alyssa Rita messages me and is like, are you sure you can't go to a Taylor Swift Sunday show? And I was like, what do you mean? What? And she's like, I may have two tickets available. <gasps> and I was like, you may or you do? And she's like, I do. And I was like, hello? So I contact all the appropriate parties to be like, can I actually do a Sunday? Blah, 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 blah. Because mm-hmm. I've got like things happening in X, Y, Z yes. that would make me maybe unavailable. Mm-hmm. Get the go ahead from them that I would be available. That's amazing. And? And now I'm going to Taylor Swift. Ah! Oh. I paid her for the tickets. Wow. And I think next week she'll be able to transfer them to me once the like marketplace thing is live and she right. can like transfer them by email or whatever. Have you bought your flights? No. Where is it? Is it Sydney or Sydney. Melbourne? Okay. Sydney. Um, and it's a Sunday show. Okay. Um, Those are the extra shows she brought out or was she always doing a show on Sunday? Um, I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure. I know I the Monday know. was definitely additional. Yeah. I'm not sure about the Sunday. Yeah, I don't know. Um. Don't have the flights booked yet, but do have accommodation. <laughs> Slay. Oh, yeah. how do you have accommodation? Well, uh, my friend who I'm going with, Elise, shout out to Elise, mm. um, was a very smart cookie. And she did it ages ago? Yes. Yeah. Did refundable accommodation way back in July when we tried to get tickets oh. and just hadn't cancelled it. <gasps> oh, that's so good. It was for like different dates, yeah. but she was able to just swap them. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't know. That's hard. Like, wow. I don't know. Good on her. Yeah. That's amazing. I'm very happy for you. You are one of the luckiest people I've ever met, by the way. Thank you. I don't feel it at the moment. 
You no, like in that instance, I did. Yeah. It was a very nice feeling. Wow, that's mm. that is some good stuff that got us good, folks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going I'm home. I'm a writer. <laughs> <laughs> You do that so much. I do. I have no <laughs> special awareness, apparently, no, which no. is frustrating because I generally do. Oh, a cat. Okay. Should we? Yeah. All right. Well, remember to like, subscribe, and, you know, maybe talk to us. We like the compliments. Let us know what you mm-hmm. like and what you don't like. Mm-hmm. Um, but if it's us, probably don't mention that. Yes. We're talking more about what we talk about in our segments. Anyway, if you've gotten this far, <laughs> call me. And we are as, as good, good as, as it gets. gets.